Hi Jurassic Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw a toy poodle, so let's get started. To draw this toy poodle, let's first start by drawing its eyes. So I'm going to come right here and draw a circle. And I'm going to come right across and draw another circle. So not too wide apart, just enough for a nose. And then let's come in here and make them draw so cute eyes. So I'm going to come in here with two small circles for highlights and a curved line at the bottom and shade in the top. And lines at the bottom. Same thing over here. So thank you for all the love you've given me for all my dog drawings so far. Please make sure to um, check out my Draw So Cute Dog playlist if you like to um, draw more and different kinds of dogs. Okay, so I've got the eyes in. Let's come above each eye, about right here. I'm just going to draw a curve over each eye. And then let's come to the center, about, let's say about right here. Not too far down, about right here. We're going to draw a curve. So say about right here, right in the center. And we're going to round off our poodle's little nose and connect it in the center. And then I'm just going to come in here and shade it in black so you can see a little bit better. Just going to leave a little highlight right there. Just drawing an oval and shade it in there. And then right in the center, let's bring down a straight line. And then let's make our poodle really happy. So let's come up with a curve and cap it off. Same thing on the other side. And up and cap it off. Aww. <laughs> and then if you like your poodle to have um, the tongue sticking out, just come right here and draw a tongue. Just kind of like drawing a U. And then in the center, just flick out a line. There. Okay, so we have that in. Now let's start to draw the face around it. So we're going to come, um, let's say, half of the eye. Let's just come out about right here to the side. I'm just going to give myself a point and do the same thing on the other side. Just because I'm drawing kind of big, so it's just easier for me to see. And from there, I'm going to start to use a bunch of little curves to go around the face and come right underneath the tongue. So I'm just going to make it a little wider right here for the cheek area. I'm going to bring it in. And maybe down here, I'm going to straighten out the line a little bit towards the bottom. So let's do the same thing over here. Just a bunch of curves, sometimes bigger, sometimes smaller. But we just want these little curves here and there. And let's just go ahead and connect it. There. So we make our poodle look really fluffy. So then from there, let's come up. Once again, using these little curves. Okay, so then from there, let's now that it's pretty even on both sides, let's go and draw some bigger curves right on top. So this is just to mimic more fur on top of the head. And then now from there, let's imagine this curve coming all the way up. So say about right here, I'll just give myself a point. I'm going to work on this side first, so I'm going to draw some floppy ears. So I'm just going to go all the way around and come back down to there. There. So same thing on the other side. So just come out, say about right, just drag a point across, about right there. And same thing. If you're not comfortable drawing these little curves in a certain shape, if you're using a pencil, just make it nice and smooth and then go in with your pencil 
and follow your line to make these curves. That might help if you're not comfortable just drawing a certain shape with these curves. So I'm just going to bring it back around on the other side. There, nice and fluffy. Okay, so from there now we're going to just draw a big curve on top. So I'm just going to make sure my center is about right here. So that would be my highest point. And let's start to bring it down. There. <laughs> nice and fluffy, right? Okay, so we have that in. So then now let's come and start to draw the body. So I'm going to center the body. So let's say about right here. Once again, we're doing the same thing. Just a bunch of little curves. And before I go any further, I'm just going to come in here and draw a curve for our collar because our toy poodle here is very much loved. <laughs> so he has a little collar. And then right in the center right here, I'm going to give him a little heart. Okay. So then from there, let's start to draw the legs. So I'm going to bring this curve down and we're just going to come all the way down. Just going to build and say about right here in this area, I'm just going to start to draw and finish off the legs. So I'm just going to bring it down, say about right there, I'll stop. And just kind of flatten it out a little bit. So same thing on this side. And let's come over here. So about right here. And we're just going to go ahead and connect it just like the other side. And flatten the bottom. Okay, so then from there, right here in the center, just draw about right here, slight curved line, and then the back legs is also the same thing, just very furry, and just tuck it in. They're so fluffy, you don't really need to draw any details on their <laughs> on their paws or anything like that. So it makes it a lot easier. So same thing over here. and connect. And let's see here, am I missing anything? So there, hope you love how this toy poodle turned out and inspires you to draw it too. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.